What is a kinematic chain? Consider an arrangement A, B, C, D where four links of different lengths are joined. Now, if we fix link AB and impart motion to link BC, we see that this arrangement moves in a definite path such that link CD and AD oscillate. Such an arrangement is called a kinematic chain. Thus, we can say that kinematic chain is an assembly of links in which the relative motions of links provide a definite motion. Note that if an assembly of links is such that the motion is not definite, then the assembly is called a non-kinematic chain. The arrangement shown is a non-kinematic chain. Let us now discuss some important terms related to kinematic chain. A kinematic chain is called a closed chain if each link is connected to at least two other links. Else it is called an open chain. A kinematic chain is called a redundant chain if there is no motion between the links. A kinematic chain can be called as a linkage, mechanism or a structure as per the arrangement of links. In a closed chain of links, if one of its links is fixed, then the arrangement is called a linkage. A four-bar chain whose link AD is fixed is an example of linkage. A linkage is called a mechanism. If the motion of any movable link results in a definite motion. And in a redundant chain, if any of its links is fixed, then it becomes a structure or a locked system. A transmission tower constructed by joining the steel members is a good example of structure. Note that the degrees of freedom of a structure is zero and that of a superstructure is negative. Let us now understand how to determine whether a chain is a locked chain or a kinematic chain by using the formula given by A. W. Klein where J is the number of binary joints, H the number of higher pairs, and L the number of links. After substituting the respective values in this formula, if the value at the left hand side is equal to the value at the right hand side, then the chain is a kinematic chain which is constrained. If the value at the left hand side is less than the value at the right hand side, then the chain is an unconstrained chain. And if the value at the left hand side is greater than the value at the right hand side, then the chain is a locked chain or structure. Related terms are 